Hey everyone, Board Gaming here. Today we have Goosebumps the Board Game. We're going to be checking it out. Now, I've had this for a while. It came out like a couple years ago. But I never really opened it. And I just found it again, so I'm like, why not? Let's check it out here. So, all of R.L. Stein's monsters have escaped. Roasting, ro roaming around all the streets of Madison. None of them want to go back, including you. Plays on their favorite monster. Players battle each other in the race to reach the typewriter before it sends them away for good. The race is on. Take a shortcut through the graveyard, but watch out for the graveyard ghouls. And if you fall behind, you can always catch a ride in the haunted car. Just hurry up before it's too late. Wow, that sounds interesting. So there's number of cards. See a little bit of the board here. A couple of cards on the back. Contents, one board, six pawns, and 65 cards. Wow. And there he is. Ha <laughs> Slappy right there. So this is based off of that... The movie, now they have, they have two of them now, but this is based off of the first one. I think it came out around 15-ish, 17-ish, I think. But yeah, let's get this plastic off. It's a little bit open. Easy to peel off here. And let's check it out. So I think I snagged this up at Books A Million. I'm not sure. It looks like the tag there, twenty four nine nine, but I'm not sure if it was. But here it is. Oh yeah, let's check a look at this monster. The monsters here. You got the mummy right there. Some graveyard ghouls in the back. Slappy, of course, in the front with the book. Vampire poodle right there, and the haunted car with a little tag up in front. And then a book. Looks like the monster from beneath the sink right there. Then a gnome. All right. Hmm. I love that new box smell. Okay, Goosebumps instructions. Always pick up a card to start your turn. Let's take a look at it. in it. Nothing else. There it is. Landmarks. Police Station Graveyard High School Amusement Park. When... When you land on a landmark, you are safe from effects of monster cards. Hmm. So there's steel spaces. There's monster mayhem cards. Praying mantis. Nothing gets in your way. You're the biggest monster in the block. Proceed to the next landmark. Haunted car, pass the player immediately ahead and take the space in front of them. You move ahead six and send the lead player to their previous landmark. Run away, all players move back five spaces, even you. Freeze ray. Protection from freeze ray. Alright. Ooh, okay, that kind of scared me. That's kind of creepy there. So, got a board and, ooh, guess these are the pawns, some cutouts here. You got this abominable snowman of Pasadena. Looking good. Yeti, little Yeti Bigfoot thing. The mummy, the werewolf of Fever Swamp. Vampire Poodle, my favorite here, Slappy. And the haunted mask. Same on the back front and back. Just reversed. Cool, cool, cool. Guessing we're gonna have some pegs to put them on. That looks cool. I remember that scene. Got the little cop slappy there. Check out the board. In the beginning, it's some spaces here. Like how it says, players beware, you're in for a scare. Huh. Like how they changed the players there. Looks like there's a bunch of books on here. Stay, say cheese and die. Remember that one? There's the house. There's a steel space. I guess these are the landmarks. The police station. 
shortcut. There's a graveyard, high school, amusement park, and then the end where you're safe and you win. Be the best monster win. I like this. There's a bunch of art on here. There's the good shot right there. Really nice. Alright, you got the Griever Ghouls locked up right over here. Ooh, that's kind of scary. That's scary. They're about to get in. What we got in here? Coins? What? What are those? What are those? I guess those are the things that the... Ooh, okay. Clown right off the bat. Those are the things that the fig... The little figures go in, or the paper figures. And then you got a little shelf that it came in. So yeah, these must be the stands. Yeah, they're the stands for the movers over here. Then you got the cards. So these are the moving cards. You got a one, so you just go one. I like the back here. Let's get these open. So there we go, we got it open. What I was saying before was it's kind of creepy, like, when you're unboxing this game. Boom, you flip over the cards. <gasps> The clown is first. Little scare there. Well, it does say it right there. <laughs> Was that intended? We'll never know. So let's look through the cards here. We got six with the vampire on it. So these are just moving cards. Where you move around the board. A ghoul there. Oh, I remember that. Remember that. I remember some of these. Another... Six right there, another ghoul. So it looks like oh, another one. Yeah, it looks like there's only a few monsters here that the cards are. Ooh, the mantis. Crane mantis would have been cool to have on a card or even a mover, like a token mover. That would have been nice. Yeah, it looks like they're just all the same going through them. Yeah, it would have been nice to have the So there's Slappy on his little mover there. In the beginning, flip over our card. Six. I landed on stay out of the basement. That's really cool there. So that's pretty much it too. Goosebumps, the board game. So there is Goosebumps, the board game. So there we go. That was Goosebumps, the board game. It was a cool, cool game. It's just to get to the end to win. But it's got some pretty good twist cards in there. It's pretty cool.